right, good, good morning, brothers and sisters. My name is Ramses Teon Nichols. I am vice president of organizing at SEIU Local 1021. I'm joined here by the, our whole delegation of 1021 of Northern California, and we stand fully in support of Resolution 106A. I want to say that I joined this union about 10 years ago by forming a union with my co-workers in a nonprofit in San Francisco. And one of the main issues on our agenda for organizing was to fight discrimination at the workplace. And back then, I was beginning to learn that labor and our union can and must be a vehicle for racial justice, not just in our community, not in our in our contracts, but also in the rest of the community. I'm proud to, to be up here with the rest of our delegation, leaders of my local, other folks from California who we've been working with around racial justice, Black Lives Matter movement in the streets, which we joined directly. We didn't have to think about it or have a meeting. We joined and hit the streets one by one, found the purple out there as we were marching to denounce police killings and, and the injustice that was happening on the streets. And we set course to what, what I see now, and I'm really proud to see our whole international union actually now stepping up and setting up what I'm proudly seeing as an anti-racist uh, movement within our organization. I, I first uh, moved to this country as a, as a migrant. I also experienced racism, and I still do. But I do believe that very much that until we actually truly believe and stand by Black Lives Matter and actually fight anti-black racism, then we will actually set a course for all other forms of oppression to be eliminated in our society. And I stand fully behind 106A for that. So please pass this resolution. Make us a better union. Do this for all of us and for the people in our community. And one more thing I want to say. It's slightly on a serious note, but many of us here from San Francisco are going back home tomorrow, and there will be one less black life in our community. A woman, her name was Jessica Williams, and she was killed by police last Thursday. And because we, we've had a movement on the streets supported by labor, by people in the community, the chief of police has resigned, and the mayor now has to take this as a serious issue, and we in labor have to be there also making our elected officials accountable at every step of the way when we see injustice. Thank you, have a great conference, folks.